Now first, before we start baking our cake, we need to wash our hands for at least 20 seconds. Come on, just wash your hands, you soap and don't pretend. Come on, just wash your hands and don't give germs a chance. Come on, just wash your hands, everybody, body, wash your hands. Okay, today we're going to be making a strawberry cake with frosting and fresh strawberries. Today we're making a Duncan Hines Perfectly Moist Strawberry Supreme. With this you're going to need one cup of water, three eggs, and a third cup of vegetable oil. And we're going to make this in a butt pan. So here we have our three eggs, we have our oil, we have our strawberries, and of course the cake mix. Use a paper towel. First, I'm gonna pour a little bit of the oil in to get it coated and then use the paper towel to, or even the spatula to, to spread it around. I don't want too much oil. Okay, we're gonna preheat the oven to 350. So we're gonna press 350 and bake. Start, baby. There it goes. So we're gonna let it preheat and then we're gonna go ahead and finish making up our cake, put it in and then wait the amount of time that it's called for and here we go. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and get our cake mix. Put it in the mixing bowl. We're gonna get our cup of water, add it. We're gonna pour a third of oil, which would be right about here. We're gonna pour that in. Then we have our three eggs. One, two, three. And then we're gonna get the whisk and we're gonna stir all that together. Normally you'd use a blend, uh, a blender, or not a blender, um, a hand mixer, but I need a little exercise so. Okay, well, now we're done mixing our cake mix. We're going to get the, with the spatula and we're going to pour it into the bunt cake um, pan. Like it's going in there evenly. I have to. Move it around a little bit. Okay, so the box says to cook it for 33 to 36 minutes. So we're gonna put it over here in the pan and in the in the oven. And we're going to set the Timer. There's the timer. We're gonna set it for 30 minutes first. Then we'll check it again in about 30 minutes and see if it needs any more. Time. Okay, it's ready. Ooh, look at that. Now we're gonna let it sit there and cool off. Let it cool off for about 15 minutes and then we'll go ahead and put the frosting on it and the strawberries. Okay, we let our cake cool. I'm gonna kind of bang the sides to kind of loosen it up. Put this on top. Let's see if it works. One, two, three. Okay, well, 
Our cake didn't turn out exactly the way we wanted it to, so we're gonna improvise. We're gonna go ahead and drizzle some of the frosting on here, add the strawberries, and put some crumbles on the top, and then layer it. We're gonna add our strawberries now that we put the drizzled the frosting on it. This is called improvising. Hopefully. <laughs> and drizzle it. And this is frosting. We're not gonna put the whole thing on there. We're gonna try and decorate it with some strawberries. It may not look the best, but I'm sure it'll taste good. Well, it doesn't look the best, but I'm sure it'll taste pretty good. Thanks for watching.